So this is what happened. This bifold door used to be up, and I took it down to make it make this video shorter. And you can see what happened when the door was sitting here on that little bracket, and this caved up inside this wooden part of the door. I'm going to show you how you can repair that. I did put some nails in right along here to try to to repair it but that was end up being a failure it worked for a while but eventually it this uh, pressed sawdust board end up giving away okay first we're gonna dig this this piece out this is the piece that that went in there that holds the door up you got that out now here is the bracket that I bought off eBay I'm sure you can get it on Amazon for those of you that would rather purchase from Amazon open it up By the way, I'll put it on uh, a link in the in the description below exactly where I got this from. Actually, how your brackets want to go in is make sure you put the, the hole to the outside or towards the framing of the door. That way, that nail go into the solid piece that's kind of sticking along the edge and pound it right in. The like that and then I set a, a nail but I meant a screw and we'll run that right up through there but I would recommend drilling a little tiny pilot hole so you don't split the wood what you want to do is pick a drill bit that's a little bit smaller than the screw I think I'll go with uh, 564 Now take yourself a small screwdriver, real tiny one like this, and if you have a little bit, you can use it on your battery operated drill. There we go, we got it in, snug. Now back at our package, we had two of these little bushings basically what they're for is is to take up if you check this slop look at all the slop in there Just put it right in that hole and tap that in with a hammer and push this bottom bracket in here we're ready and I'll probably have to adjust that in some because of the thickness here from the old door that way it'll lower the door down now you can kind of see how that looks and now we'll go ahead and set the door back in the same way as we took it out by putting this piece in first and then up at the other end we will push down on the bracket and at this end, this is the top. See how that spring loaded? And that's how you put it back in, as you probably knew whenever you took it out. Now this is the other door. I can show you how it's supposed to look. But a good way to prevent a failure is just going ahead and purchase these. Of course, you know that there's two in a pack. And just go ahead and then repair this. Before we put the door in, you'll you want to check this bracket up here and see if this is loose and you can kind of see how that moves so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and repair this but I'm not going to show it in this video go ahead and click on the little button up here that popped up 
or click on the thumbnail at the end of this video for another video two or three minute video will show you how we repair these so that they don't fail because that's probably what's going to happen next if we don't take care of it now okay we got that in you can see how the door works it works as it should and this bracket in here like that that is the permanent fix and kind of wish we wouldn't have did that but that's how we learn and hopefully hopefully you learned something from this video and if you did and you'd like to see something in the future that I kind of come up with go ahead and subscribe but on your way out make sure you hit that notification bell and the thumbs up because that helps us help you